The Southern African Development Community, the SADC, has clarified that it does not conduct elections in its member states. In a statement seen by this publication, the regional bloc said its role is to observe elections, report and make recommendations. This clarification comes amid calls by Zimbabwe's main opposition party, the Triple C, is led by Nelson Chapmisa for SADC to intervene to resolve the political deadlock which followed the 23 August 2023 harmonized elections. However, the SADC Secretariat reiterated that its role is strictly limited to election observation rather than conducting election in its member states. The statement read, SADC electoral observation missions only observe elections. SADC does not conduct elections in its member states but observe them, would then make recommendations. Understand the role of SADAC when it comes to observing elections. Our mandate is only to observe and issue a report. The SADAC election observer mission, the African Union Commissioner and the ECF SADAC observer missions joint statement on Zimbabwe 2023 elections. The Triple C has been urging SADAC to pressure Zimbabwe into holding fresh elections due to alleged irregularities in the previous harmonized elections. The Triple C expressed concerns about the perceived bias of the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission and called for an independent board like the SADAC, the African Union, or the United Nations to oversee a new election. The Citizens Coalition for Change rejected the results of the presidential election stating that they do not accurately represent how the election voted. The party alleges collusion between the Zimbabwe Electoral Commission and the ruling party, the SANU-PF, accusing them of manipulating the results of in favor of President Emerson Mnangagwa. So this is what the Southern African Development Community is saying. They are saying that they do not hold elections in its member countries but however they observe elections and make a report so now they have said that they are waiting for the final report since what they produced was only the interim report now they are waiting for the final report and after the final report they make recommendations about what is to happen so this is where the hope of uh, the triple C lies and the advocate news and Jamisa's hope lies in that in making those recommendations the SADAC will give the recommendation to say let's have a fresh election in Zimbabwe and also if it does this will, this is supposed to pressure the government into giving in since we are seeing that they have said that we do not hold elections in, in 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 our member states but what we actually do is to make a recommendation if they recommend anything it will definitely give pressure just like how the interim observer report did to them they got some pressure into uh, and they started refusing they started uh, throwing back they started giving tantrums and all that was meant to to sort of like uh, fight back at the report so what advocate nelson chamisa was, was hoping is that once those recommendations are made you find a basis to see even sadek says that but once he begins on his diplomatic offensive people will be guided by those recommendations as made by the sadak observer mission